Today, I'm gonna to show you five really good Chrome extensions that will actually change your life. Like honestly, your life will be changed. No, I'm kidding. Anyways, the first one is Adblock. Now, the reason why this ad blocker is so good is because if you go on YouTube and you go and you watch a specific channel, if you go to your extensions and click on Adblock, you can actually allow ads on that specific channel and it actually helps the creator immensely. For small time creators, most of the time they really don't have sponsorships and if they do, they're really bad. Trust me, for me personally, I run solely on ads. So obviously I'm gonna advocate for you having this specific extension and allowing ads on my channel, but I think it's actually a nifty feature as a person and not as a content creator. Now, getting rid of that YouTube stuff, next up we have NightTab. Now, NightTab I actually use all the time on my May computer because it's really easy to use. Just add it to Chrome and click Add Extension, and what it'll do is it will replace your home screen with a new one. So if you open up a new tab and you click Keep It, you now have this new and fancy home screen on Chrome and you can customize it to your heart's extent. There are some limitations and I have a massive video on it somewhere. It's gonna be on the little eye thing. But anyways, it allows you to have different icons and you can go to different websites. And I think it just looks a lot nicer than the default one. Now, next up we have Bitwarden. Now I use Bitwarden all the time. I used to be a LastPass user, which is a password manager, but then they turned paid where literally you would have to pay however much a month just to use LastPass on multiple devices. So if you had a computer and a phone, you'd have to pay $5 a month or whatever they were charging. I thought it was ridiculous. Now to download Bitwarden, you just need to click on the download button and then all you need to do is create an account and you can have it as a desktop client or a web browser. I personally prefer the web browser the most. So click on Google Chrome. It'll take you to the web store and you click add to Chrome. Next up, we have go full page. Now I used to use this a lot, but it is a fantastic application because if you have a super long page, you could take the whole screenshot of the page. So click add to Chrome, click add extension. So to use this application, all you need to do is just go to any website that you want to get a full screen capture of, click on the extensions, click on the actual extension, and it will full screen capture. Now, mind you, if it's an infinitely loading page like YouTube, man, it's going to take a little bit of time to capture. But when you do capture it and it does get to the end, damn it captures the whole thing now you could save it as pdf or you could save it as a png that's all up to you now for the last extension we have stay focused now i'm pretty decent with time management but this is really good if you just go on reddit 24 7 and you never shower so click add to chrome then click add extension like normal there's really nothing new so the way that this extension works is that if you go into your extensions and open it up you have a timer on specific sites and to make it so that you actually have the timer you need to click block this entire site and what it will do is if you go back into stay focused what it will do is start counting down the amount of time you have now you can turn on advanced options you can set custom urls and you can go into the settings and change the time for each website so 10 minutes a day is uh is very restrictive but you can change it to whatever you want and it's just really good because once it actually ends you can't go on the website anymore the extension will prevent you and it's a good way of kind of just getting yourself more on track and more productive and that wraps up the installation portion of the video if it worked like and subscribe and if you want to support the channel even further just turn off your ad blocker when you watch my videos and if for some odd reason it didn't work out for you feel free to leave a comment in the comment section or join my discord and put your issue in the help channel and i will help you out as soon as i can now let's get on to the uninstall portion of the video. Now let's say any one of these extensions are a little too crazy for you and you want to get rid of them. Well, technically you could go back to the web store and click remove from Chrome, but the easiest way to do it is go into your extensions on the top right, click on the three dots for each extension and click remove from Chrome. Now for Bitwarden, if you remove the extension, you will still have your account made. So if you want to delete that, you'll have to go through that process. But in any case, I feel like it is definitely good because I've seen a lot of people with the same password just get hacked and it's pretty sad. Anyways, my password is I-L-Y. Mwah.